Hello, this is Ashley with Pipeline ROI, and today I'll be showing you a very short video about how to create a saved IDX search using uh, the city as the, the delimiter for the searcher filter. To get to the back end where we'll create a search, I'm going to, after the slash, put in inbound marketing to get into the dashboard. It's going to ask me to log in. And I'm going to click on targeted IDX search. This is what you're going to click on to get started, whether you're doing it for a zip code, a city, or, or manually drawing your boundary area, because there's three different ways you can create searches. We're going to go to search manager. Um, as you can see, we have about 31 different searches that we've already set up on this account um, using the various different methods. So we're going to click on create a new custom search and we're going to, um, since this is based on the city, I'm going to use the city name that I'll be setting it up for and, and it'll pull that up, let you know that it found it. It's going to jump you over there and so anything that's tagged as being that address is what will show up in our search. Um, we want residential properties and here's where you can add some additional um, features um, depending on your MLS is what will show here um, you don't have to set that up um, just because it does can narrow the search um, but if you have a you're in a large metropolitan area or something like that that has um, a lot of a certain type of property or that's the property that you really do specialize in then yes by all means use these but for for most of you you don't necessarily need to um, if you wanted to you could set up one that's a city search and then go back in and do a more specific subset if you wanted to um, but I'm going to save the search we don't need to do anything on that page and um, and in one of our other videos, we'll show you how to actually get that added to where that will show. But that's how you create a search by city. Thanks, you guys, and have a great day.